In order to share a Wakelet collection, we have to make sure that the visibility of our collection that we wish to share is set to either public or unlisted. By default, when we create a collection, it is set to private. Notice that I'm here in my Wakelet homepage, I'm viewing my collections, and I can see without even opening the collection which collections are set to private. They have this little lock here. I can always change the visibility without opening the collection by simply clicking on that little icon, in this case, the lock symbol. Notice that I can change it to public, which means that everyone can see this collection. So any of my followers on uh, Wakelet, as well as really any Wakelet community members could potentially search for this Wakelet collection. Notice that I don't have to go public. I can go unlisted. With unlisted, I get a link and only the individuals that I give the link to can actually see this collection. If I leave it private, then only I can see the collection. So for this particular uh, Google for EDU apps and tools collection, let's make it unlisted. I want to share it with my class. So I'm going to click on unlisted and click save. All right, now in order to share this collection, I do have to click on it to view the collection. But now that I've changed it to unlisted, I'm now able to click the share button. Notice that I can share my collection in a variety of ways. I could give my class the QR code or copy the link to share in an email. I can also share directly to my Google Classroom as well as to my Microsoft Teams. So I'm going to choose to share this particular collection to my Google Classroom. I'm gonna click the Google Classroom icon and I'm going to select my remote learning class. And we're going to make this a class material. And I simply click go. Notice that I can now customize this class material so I can add a title. I can add a description that's optional. And notice that I can choose whether I want to uh, schedule this to post later or post right away. Now, before I do that though, I do wanna show you that I can select whether I want this to go to all students or maybe this Wakelet collection is just supporting resources for a specific student. So I would select that student. I can organize by topic. And when I'm ready, click post. To view the collection as a student, I would simply access my Google Classroom and I would find where my teacher has posted it. In this case, the teacher has posted it under the topic daily check-in and I would simply expand the class material and click on the link for the Wakelet collection. Notice that the collection loads in a new tab and I do not have to sign in or have an account with Wakelet in order to view and interact with this collection. If I wanted to save the collection in Wakelet itself or follow Mrs. McKee, I would have to have an account. But again, this collection has been uh, made accessible uh, for all students by the teacher. And therefore, students do not need an account with Wakelet in order to view and access the resources shared.